shoot! Dude, how'd you... He, like, brain ninja'd me in just the freaking trailer. Hey, yo. I see M. Night Shyamalan has a new movie. The M. Night Shyamalan. So Warner Brothers Pictures Trap by M. Night Shyamalan. I really love M. Night Shyamalan. I love his movies in general. The only movie I didn't really care for was The Happening, but I did like Lady in the Water. <laughs> it wasn't great. It was weird as, as hell. <laughs> it really was, but I did like it. Uh, I like The Village as well. Um, but you know, The Sixth Sense, Unbreakable. Unbreakable was great. Glass was all right. Split was great. The Visit. Uh, I did like Old. And I thought Knock at the Cabin was a beautiful movie. I know that's kind of dark and crazy that it's like the end of the world and Four Horsemen. And I thought, oh, it's so beautiful. I thought it was really well done. And the actor and the acting was great too. So I can't wait to see this. And we're going to get right into it. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for Lady Raven. Hurry, come on, come on. Wait, 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 wait. I got to tie my shoe. No dad jokes. This is serious. Come on. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I mean, Lady Raven. Save me for myself. They said slap dad. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. This is literally the best day of my life. <laughs> oh, nothing's gonna happen without my child near me. Oh, heck no. Right? Hi. Cooper, Jamie. What's with all the police trucks outside? The camera's everywhere, Jamie. I'm not supposed to tell. Something happening? Don't rat me out. I won't. You need a butcher? Freaking nut job that goes around just chopping people up. Well, the feds or whatever heard that he's gonna be here today, so they set up a trap for him. Why do you seem excited about it? This whole concert? It's a trap. They're watching all the exits, checking everyone that leaves. There's no way to get out of here. Sorry, Riley. Oh <laughs> my god. Your daughter's never gonna forget this day. <gasps> Poor thing. Oh my god, he's like his character in Black Mirror. He's kinda dope, right? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Whoa! <gasps> Didn't see that coming. I'm watching it again. Oh my god, I hate that. I mean, I love it, but I hate it. I hate the un unreliable character. I'm not used to seeing Josh Hartman as the bad guy. Oh, his poor daughter. Oh my god. Shoot, that looks good. <gasps> oh my god, I'm so excited for that. I'm gonna watch that. Dude, how'd you... He like brain ninja'd me in just the freaking trailer. So Josh Hart, he, that mean, that guy, I, I mean, I, I've seen Josh Hart in, in movies, right? I've only seen him be a bad guy once and that was an episode of Black Mirror. But seeing him as the bad guy in this, so he's the butcher. He's being like, oh, I'm such a cool dad. <laughs> I'm taking my daughter to this uh, concert and she's gonna love it. We're gonna have a great time. What's with all the security? What's with all the cameras? Oh, they think the butcher's here, so they set a trap. How did they know that this would work? Does the singer know? They got the butcher in this arena. They locked it down basically in order to flush out the killer based on some kind of profile they have on him. 
and his daughter's there. And I'm sure the worst thing to him would be caught, but also for his daughter to realize that he's the butcher. That poor child. But what if she knows? That's the thing about when certain things happened. I, there's plenty of true crime. I watch too much true crime. There's plenty of instances where the per one of the people in the home is this person and they had no sign. Well, they had no indication. There might've been signs that something was odd, but sometimes there's no signs. It's just like, I didn't know that he was doing this or she was doing this or this was happening. And then society is like, how could you not know? So I'm wondering if the daughter had an inclination because it's just like Shyamalan to do something twisted like that. But I'm sure, oh, I'm thinking of so many ways he could spin this. The daughter's the butcher. <laughs> I'm sorry, is that rude? Was, but no, that's my point. Um, I'm sure one of the worst things in the world is not for him just to get caught, but for his daughter, who probably sees him as her hero, to be known as the butcher. That is some trauma. And that poor child. And knowing that Shyamalan did this, how's he going to spin that? Oh, he's sick. <laughs> I can't wait. I can't wait. I'm going to gobble this movie up. Oh, I can't wait. I can't wait. All right. That was good. Fallout forever. Talk to you guys later. See you in the next one. Farewell. Whoop. I can't wait.